Hey friends, welcome back to another hot news clip. Hope you're doing pretty well. I want to talk to you today about the things that we're expecting from AMD. April 29th is the next confirmed official launch of some brand new AMD products, a brand new CPU and a brand new GPU from Team Red. They're going to be unveiled. Are you excited? Well, you should be only if you were anticipating buying stuff that was already out on the market. You see, my friends, we already did a video on this last week about how AMD is planning planning on unveiling the 50th anniversary edition of the Radeon or the Ryzen 7 2700X. We also covered in the main hot news channel how we're also going to get a 50th anniversary RX 590 from Sapphire in gold. And then there's also going to be a 50th anniversary edition Gigabyte X470 motherboard. But on top of that, it appears that not only is the official AMD 50th anniversary Ryzen 7 coming out, we are also getting a 50th anniversary edition of the Radeon 7. So both of these seem to be unveiling and at least according to this promotion that we have right here, it's saying April 29th is the day that it's coming out. So just in about five days, a brand new Radeon 7 and a brand new Ryzen 7 2700X could be yours for just about $50 more each than what they currently retail for at this point. I mean, it makes sense. 50th anniversary, increase the price $50. Now there's no word as to whether or not these are going to be physically different stuff. Uh, hopefully the GPU and the CPU are cherry picked so that they actually have better quality. The silicon lottery is in their favor. So you're getting higher overclocks out of the box out of both of those and not just the fact that it's going to be a hideous new color scheme based on the gold thing that we've seen from Sapphire, which just looked idiotic. That's my perspective. Some people have said it's the best graphics card that they've ever seen. I am not a fan of it. So the, the gold box on the 2700 X, you can see it's there. Uh, the Radeon 7 looks like it could be coming in red. I could also see them just turning it into a gold shroud instead of it being a silver shroud like it is there. Going red would also be okay. Uh, but yeah, new AMD stuff. And I think this top comment that I read on the video cards article about this uh, kind of sums up how I feel about it. Wow, they've made 50 Radeon 7 cards now. Production is increasing. It's fantastic. I'm so glad that they've sold over 70 of these things. Totally worth it. Definitely not a generation old tech that should have not probably been released and everybody could have just waited for Navi because nobody really wanted the Radeon 7 in the first place. And it's not really a holdover for anything because nobody was expecting AMD to come out with it at all. So who cares? Anyways, that's my perspective on it. What do you think of the 50th anniversary edition of the Radeon 7 and the Ryzen 7 2700X as well as the Sapphire 590 and the Gigabyte X470? Are these products that interests you. Were you interested in the Intel i7-8086K for the 40th anniversary edition of the x86 architecture? I want to hear, do you care at all about special edition stuff like this? Is this something that you would buy and then use or buy and then keep on a shelf? Keen to hear from you down in the comments down below. Don't forget to hit the like button on this video. If you enjoyed it, get subscribed to stay up to date on all of our hot news and I'll see you, see you your face. See you guys. Bye in the next video. Hello.